good morning it's almost 9 30 i just woke up and i'm gonna take you along for a few days in my life because i'm not working today or next four days so i'm not working any extras this week and i'm so happy for that because i have to catch up on a lot of my studies that i have missed last week and that's what we're doing it's such a good hair day for me i just washed my hair yesterday and it looks so pretty and just please ignore the weird pimples on my face i'm breaking out i don't know why maybe it's just because of the heat uh, my skin is turning oily again which is so annoying and i need to do something about it i don't know what but i need to i just have my meeting in like a half an hour with my supervisor to discuss progress of the dissertation and once i'm done i have a small submission tomorrow so i have to work on that and pretty much just that for the day i just better get ready for the quick meeting and then we'll have some breakfast let's start our day together okay i just got off the meeting and i have to make so many changes i have to submit my supervisor a document in like two hours which I haven't even started. So I have to just quickly eat something now because I'm really hungry. So I have to eat my breakfast and just get started on that document. <laughs> and I just submitted I just emailed the document to my supervisor for a quick check and I still have to do another two documents like writing a summary of the progress and stuff like that so we're gonna do that but not here I just got dressed quickly like through just a little short on the top here and I thought let's go to a cafe and work because it's a nice weather outside so let's take all the advantage of that and let's have nice cold beverage and get working so let's go out Because I ate just a sandwich there, so I'm not pretty hungry. We'll fill up on chips. And also, got some yogurt. Got some chicken for dinner. And ice cream. We got this multi pack for the chicken. That's it. That's it we got. <laughs> we literally. The juice, that juice cans that we got. Like mango juice, passion fruit juice. That's it. I just can't believe how much we spend just to get the basic stuff like we're cooking at home we're not eating out so just these are just the ingredients to cook that food home and it's costing us like 30 pounds i'll just quickly put this all away and we have to hit the gym and then we have some chips so okay i still have to do some work um that is pending i think just one document because i was able to complete the rest of the three and it's just the one document that's remaining. Oh, sometimes wish I knew it to fly all the way from tomorrow. Went to the gym, came home, just came out of a nice shower. Now, I just want to be done with the tomorrow's submission. So I want to have everything ready before tomorrow, before I sleep, even before I have my dinner. I'm just going to do that quickly. Let's that is done we can chill maybe read the book i badly want to like you know stay awake till late night and just finish that book once and for all a because it's really interesting and b i want to start a new book <laughs> really wanting to start a new book i want to read new but i have like promised myself i won't start another book before i have finished the previous one so i just can't so I have to finish that book. I'm planning maybe today I can do that. I was so tired yesterday, so I directly went to sleep. But today, I think 
I might do that. I might stay a little late and just finish that book once I'm done with the documents. <laughs> yesterday after reading quite nice few pages of the book i mean i'm right now at like 150 and the book is like 400 pages so i'm hoping to finish it this week definitely like by the end of this vlog today's the submission so i'm ready with that and it's just a normal study day today you might in the afternoon go out and work in a cafe but i don't know i'm not sure because we all have our lunch ready from yesterday's dinner i'm just gonna have my breakfast now because i'm really hungry we had dinner super early yesterday like we were done by 7 p.m i woke up so hungry today so i had my coffee not gonna have my granola as my breakfast and then sit down study for some time i also have to clean this space a little bit i actually decide to clean every single day just for like 10 to 15 minutes so i don't have to like clean one whole day on a sunday let's start the day had our lunch and I just saw on the Instagram story of the accommodation that it's international ice cream day today and they have like huge ice cream flavors down at the reception and they have mentioned that bring your own bowl and create your own sundae ice cream sundae so we're just gonna go with the bowl and see what we can make and pick and have a nice ice cream and it's apparently raining outside so it's not really kind of an ice cream noon, but free ice cream. Can't say no to that. It's pouring outside so bad and it's such an unproductive weather right now. I hate it. I really wanted to study today and I'm just blaming it on the weather because that is not very supportive. And yeah, that's how, that's how it happens, guys. Like, that's how every day is. Like, I wake up, I decide one thing, end up doing something else. Because I literally have realized this whole year or whole 10 months I've been living here that it's so different. And it's not going to be always as you plan in your head. It's definitely not going to be always the same as you plan. So you have to be so open and flexible to your, say, mood swings or your just what you listen to, what your body wants, what your mind wants. Sometimes you're just so tired mentally, you want to take rest. The other days you're tired physically, so you want to take rest. And then there are just a teeny bit of days where you're actually feeling the best. And that's where you just take it all in and just work or study or do the, the thing that you want to be doing, right? The thing you have been procrastinating because of all the shit that is happening. So, it's just life. And I feel like I'm talking like an old grandma, but I mean, that is so, it's, it's difficult, but it's definitely challenging and I'm getting to learn so many things and just learning to be grateful for such small things that I never even thought about to be grateful for and that's really a really good feeling so yeah I am not very much in the mood now to study and be productive so what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna be editing the video now I have two videos to edit one is almost done and the second one I haven't even started so I just want to finish the first one and upload it while I start with the second one
morning guys uh, we just woke up feeling a little cold i guess because it was raining so crazy last night i think it just stopped some time back and yeah i'm feeling definitely feeling a little cold I'm having my coffee i just love this mug got got it from urban afters home and they have such cute mugs i really love it i mean the coffee is barely this filled but still it looks so cute to like just hold on and have it i finished reading this book like literally half i'm at page 200 now so i'm hoping i'll finish 100 more pages today and uh, the last 100 tomorrow so as i said we should be done reading this book by the end of this vlog so yeah today's agenda is mostly i have to edit the video that i will be posting tomorrow and then i have to study also clean the house it's a big mess now because i didn't end up cleaning or just doing anything yesterday so i have a big pile of dishes i like didn't even have the mug to have my coffee and today i had to wash it first so i have a big pile of dishes to clean i have to sweep the floor there's so much dust i've been sneezing since i woke up because there's literally so much dust now around so i have to clean that up and uh, definitely study i have to go to bnm maybe because i have to stock a few things like tissues and stuff so we can do that and yeah the afternoon like after one o'clock would be definitely a whole focused study sesh till probably evening dinner time that's what my plan is and i know yesterday was like all over the place i said a few things in the morning that i'd be doing and i did end up doing that which is completely okay but today i just want to stick to what i have on my agenda what my things are what my priorities are so let's start the day together and let's have the coffee first cheers so i'm just having a little granola yogurt bowl it's not technically a bowl but there was just some leftover yogurt so i just put some granola in there and it's so tasty meanwhile i'm importing the videos to the ipad so i can start editing the vlog while it's happening i am also multitasking and looking for some nice recipe ideas oh my god i cleaned the house so badly i mean i scraped the whole floor i haven't like i just used to sweep around when there was a lot of dust but i never like mopped it it was almost after two months that i mopped the floor and it had like big black spots i don't know from where but it was so bad and i feel like the flooring might have gone a shade lighter it is that clean so but i feel so good that looking at everything spot on like i love the clean feeling i love when everything is at its place and there's no clutter around that's the best part but yeah cleaning is not definitely because it's exhausting and i'm really tired but we have to do what we have to do so we are now gonna get ready go to bnm i have to pick some stuff so i am all ready did a nice little makeup and oh my god the eyeliner matched so perfect I've never been able to do that and it looks so cute have a little blush on it started raining but now it's again sunny really confused of what I'm gonna do because if it starts raining I'm not gonna be able to go to B&M and get some stuff because it's gonna be wet by the time I come home and if it's not raining I can go but I just can't decide what to do I think it's pretty sunny now so before it starts raining again I should start walking <laughs> I literally waited for the bus for 15 to 20 minutes and all the buses got cancelled and delayed and something or the other and oh I was so annoyed standing there if I would have decided to just go walking instead of a bus I would have been at BNM by now so it was really annoying that the bus didn't show up 
So I just went to co-op, got some groceries and we're here. I'm just gonna leave the B&M stuff to tomorrow now. See, it happens, right? It's always not gonna be as you planned again because stuff is happening. So uh, tomorrow is a Sunday and yeah, we'll make sure tomorrow early morning we go to B&M and get the stuff. But for today, I have to start studying because I haven't been doing that lately. As you saw in the last two days, I haven't studied. So I have to now sincerely focus for some time and do my studying, do my work on my dissertation. I got off from study some time back and it was actually while I was studying was feeling very overwhelming and I wasn't feeling the best so I took a nice shower and sat down to journal for some time and ended up journaling for almost like an hour now so probably I'm just gonna cook some dinner and read my book maybe just sleep and I'll directly talk to you guys tomorrow now, so I'll see you tomorrow. It's almost 5 p.m. and I couldn't vlog the whole day because I was called in for an extra shift at like 9 a.m. and I got back like at 3, 3.30. And I had my lunch just now and I'm so, so tired. So I'm just gonna have like a nice long everything shower for some time and then probably just, you know, just end up like sleeping or maybe reading my book for some time. I don't really have anything because I actually wanted to go to B&M, get some laundry for today, but I couldn't do anything. So that's okay. So I'm gonna just go and have a nice shower now and then just probably read the book. So we can do that together actually. We can read some book together. So if you are procrastinating and you're watching this right now, just go grab your book and we'll read that together. Mm -hmm. 